Welcome back to Midnight Mysteries Haunted Houdini. This is episode 8. Yeah. So we're gonna jump in. And we just got out of the coffin here. So. Hmm? We're buried alive. I guess. Oh, there's one of those. Oh. Okay. Now I unlocked it again. Oh. Oh, yeah. I might have done that. If oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I have to find stuff here again. Yeah. Um, before we go on, I just want to talk a bit, basically. So, I just want to say that I bought a book today about symbols and symbolism and stuff. Because I, I love that. And it was a book sale. So, huh. And I discovered ravens. Yes, they usually mean death and stuff. But in some African and North American cultures... The raven is also the guide for the dead on their journey. So that we have ravens here as hints. Both have to do... Uh, could, I mean, I don't know what the developers have thought about, but it's pretty good, actually, because... Yeah, we're dealing with lots of dead people, but the ravens are also guides for the dead, and... We're dealing with dead people, and the ravens guide us. So, yeah, that's what I wanted to say. Let's get out of here. Whoa, hello. Is this where we were? Yeah, okay. Hmm? So this is nice. What is this? Oh, okay. This whole thing here. Okay. Big freaking hitbox. Hmm? Whoa, that hitbox is big. Alright. So... Are there any ravens and stuff or stuff here? Uh, we don't seem to be able to do anything here. I think. Absolutely nothing is dead. Haha. <laughs> Alright, um, let's click here. I don't think this is gonna be nice. Hmm? Exactly. I was a bit more... A bit less afraid this time, because I was actually an kind of anticipating that. But yeah, those hands are scary. Oh god. But yeah, I was uh, a bit more... Yeah, whatever. Let's go. The grave of Houdini's mother. Did Houdini actually escape death? Or did someone try to make a statement? Trying to make a statement create this passage to remove the body? That's a good question. Are there any sounds here? Oh yeah, there are. Cecilia Weiss. Okay. Oh, Raven! Oh, those. Raven! Okay, we can go right. Can we do anything here? We cannot go left. So we cannot do anything here. We can only go right. Let's go right. Oh. After this ordeal, there must be a couple pieces of information to learn before I can move on. Alright, I guess that was pretty informative, actually. What was that? Okay, let's see, what is this? There's no death of date of death for Bess. That means she was never buried in the same cemetery. Harry and Bess were separated in death. Houdini and beloved wife. That is... Yeah. Alright. So what is this? Uh, Houdini died in on, ha on Halloween. That is too much of a coincidence to be natural. Uh, I'd say so, yes. There's a raven. Uh -huh. Thank you. Is there any other stuff here? I don't know, I don't think so. Oh my god! Holy crap! Uh, I was- oh, we're back here! Alright, oh, hello! Now you know the circumstances of Houdini's death. I actually don't, but okay. Whatever you say, Arthur Conan Doyle. Bess and Harry devised a code that he would give her at a seance on the anniversary of his death. 
contact would prove Houdini could escape death, and they would be joined again for eternity. Discover the code. Okay. Okay, here. I learned a lot when Bess steered me to Montreal and then Detroit. Whitehead was a lackey who ruptured Houdini's appendix so he would end up in a hospital for the killers of the killer's choosing. Someone with unquestioned access to hospital administered a suspicious substance to Houdini which ended with burial in a coffin with an escape hatch. Houdini died on Halloween which seems like more than a coincidence. Arthur Conan Doyle is no longer a suspect. Bess and Houdini were buried in different graveyards. Their separation in the afterlife must be unbearable. Doyle has informed me that Bess and Harry devised a code that Harry would give if there was any way he could make contact with her from the beyond. I need to find the code. Alright, oh. Bess Houdini conducts a seance on, Halloween anniversary, on the Halloween anniversary of her husband's death. The couple had arranged for a secret code to be given by Houdini to prove the existence of life from beyond the grave. After several years of the ritual, no contact has been made. Numerous mediums in the United States and Europe have claimed to have received messages from Houdini, but none have produced the secret code. Uh, oh, stop that! Why was Bess conducting the seances? She wasn't a medium and never claimed to have any extraordinary powers. Did she already know these attempts would fail? Why do, does this game keep giving jump scares? And that was really just random. That wasn't even a fun jump scare or a scary jump scare, that was just random. Key and silver dollars, right? Oh god, hello Bess. Give me what I need so I may share some information with you. Alright, more keys. Oh, we're back to Harry Houdini, King of Cards stuff. What is this? Funeral program. Oh, there's one of those. And okay, uh, here, I guess. In loving memory, Wilhelmina Beatrice Houdini. Feb oh, 1943. Gate of Heaven Cemetery, Hawthorne, New York. Bess died on a train bound from New York to California. She died on a train. Circumstances are pointing to the ghost of Walter for fil fulfilling his threat on the Houdini family. Yes, but everyone always... We already hate Walter. Meet me and we'll do a trick together. Holy freaking crap! Stop that! Ghost to stop being aggressive all the time, please. Can we go outside? Oh, more keys. More keys. Uh, any keys here? Oh, yeah, there's a key. Any more keys in here? Oh! Nine keys before you travel. Alright, so... I didn't think we were supposed to go in here, but obviously we were. I'll go into the house again first, then. Upstairs. Here's a key. And in here we have a scene. And... Keys. Okay, after we do this trick, is something gonna jump at us again? Seriously? Conjuring. Oh, key. Okay. Miracle mongers and their method. What? No, I wanted that clover. Crap! Oh, well. Hidden object scene. Oh, uh, we need a lot of stuff. I'm just gonna click. Well, this didn't work out very well, did it? Stupid ward fire! Circus coupon ticket, right? Eh. 
I saw a lady in half. Let's see here. If Bess died in a train, did Walter fulfill his threat? Was her death part of the conspiracy to kill Harry Houdini? My main task is to find the code that was to link Harry and Bess into afterlife. Could it be somewhere in the house? Bess wants me to participate in another magic trick. The faint sound of a saw gives me a clue. I'll start by exploring the study and workshop to learn more about performing the saw a lady in half trick. Alright, oh a finger, lovely, oh moustache, moustache. I want an alligator cap. What's an alligator cap? I don't even know what that is. Ant liquid chicken? What? Oh, of course, liquid chicken. Oh, yeah, yeah, the green are. Oh, yeah, I remember now. Okay, uh. Help me, Raven. I've clicked that! Straps. Oh yeah, I thought it was something like that. All right. Whoa. Why are you locking yourself on me? Wait, I have nine keys. I'm sorry. Whoa. Hello, goodbye, I meant house, I guess. Do the scene here first. Oh, goody, lots of stuff. Tassels and I don't know what more. It's tassel. Oh, we apparently needed some ducks. Fancy head covering. <sighs> fake feet. Um, why would I want to find fake feet? But all right. Pocket watch and a jar. There's a jar. Where's this pocket watch they're talking about? And these fake feet. Chair. Fake feet. Ah, uh, there. Oh, of course I need fake feet. Uh, where's the pocket watch? Oh, there. And now we need loggers saw handles. <laughs> what does that mean? What? <laughs> All right. Uh, Raven, help me, please. Okay. I, of course, I guess. All right. Here you are. Here you have nine keys, I guess. I don't know how much of this I want to see, really. I'm gonna back away from the screen. That blueprint? Alright. So where's the saw, then? Oh, duck targets? I don't know where the saw is. Where's the saw blade? What? I must be in serious blindness or something. Help me, Raven. Find the keys. Take the saw blade. Oh, I'm not done here. Well, that explains it. What? Oh my god. Whoa, how much did I not miss that? 
Alright, let's combine saw and saw handles. Okay, let's saw her. And we're gonna get a jump scare soon, I think. And I'm probably gonna... Okay, I'm gonna be real scared even though I know it. Come on. Saw her in half. Alright. Okay, New York, Coney Island, 1893. So this is this is where the Houdini family got their start in show business. Oh, hello. You want a ticket? I want that one first. Your hard-earned money. What, money? Yeah, okay. Here you go, money. See what it says. Coney Island in the late 1800s. This is where Bass and Harry started in show business. The code must have its origins to their early days together. Bass was a singer and magician. Mu I'm sorry, musician. Before she joined Harry's magic act. So I'll start at the Calliope. Or Calliope. Whatever. Ten coup Oh, ten coupon tickets. Ten tickets will... Get your token every time. Alright. Now let's go here. A little searching. I can get this Calliope working. Oh. <gasps> Raven. Four pipes missing. I have one pipe. Need four pipes. We need all four. All right. At the same time, I guess. Go in here. Raven. More clovers. And oh, I thought it was. <laughs> I thought I was gonna get the pigeons. <laughs> what is over here? Oh. Another ticket. Lock is rusted shut and I can't reach the ticket. That's too bad for you or me, I guess. Oh, what was that? That's a spike litter rod. Let's use our spike litter rod. Ha ha. That's like the first time ever you can actually use something you find in the same place. That's nice. Oh my god, I didn't mean to click, but sure, we'll do the hidden object scene. The unmasking of Robert Houdini. Harry Houdini. Houdini took his stage name as a tribute to Robert who Ho Oh, I'm sorry, Houdin, obviously, I don't know. And then he wrote a book debunking the man that had to have made a few enemies. <laughs> yeah, doesn't really seem like the right way to go. Stealing someone's name and then <laughs> writing a book about how they're fake? Mm. Yeah, no. Oh, I got a ball. Alright. Or we got a ball. Hardeen, brother of Houdini. Mental supreme. Mentalist supreme. The Houdini brothers split up when Bess entered the act. Theodore took the name Hardeen in his own act. He was a mentalist, an escape artist like his brother. Popcorn. Oh, hello. Oh, more boss, alright. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm just clicking random. I want the cat! Body interior. Okay, we want to find something which is inside a body, or just a schematic of the inside of a body? Oh, of course, skeleton. Magic trick blades. What do those look like? And have I clicked them before? Probably. But I don't know what they look like. Oh, an owl! Oh, there. Yeah, magic trick blades. Uh, we're done here for now, I guess, so we'll go in here. 
Oh, here's the Houdini, the mysterious Harry, and La Petite Pessie. Pessie. Do we have a raven here? I don't think so. Alright, but um, we will end this episode here. I think that would be rather a good spot. So, and time's up. So yeah, that was those episode whatever, 8 or 9. God, I can't even remember what I'm doing anymore. 8, I think. Of Midnight Mysteries Haunted Houdini. And um, uh, I hope you're enjoying the game. Uh, I'm thinking of trying out the other Haunted uh, Midnight Mysteries games. At least uh, number 2 and number 3. So. Uh, but um, thank you guys so much for watching. Take care and I'll see you soon.